Hello and welcome to Fresh Manna Ministries and this is a Fresh Manna Moment. This is an inspirational expose on concepts of biblical principles and topical study. I am Rev. Dr. Alan G. Jenkins, Jr., one of the ministers of the Fresh Manna Ministries International. These messages are designed to bring a sense of confidence as your walk with the Lord is enhanced through the embellishment of the Word of God in Scripture. Let's prepare for another topical experience in the Word. Fresh Manna Moments. The Mind of Christ. Let the same mind be in you that was in Christ Jesus. Philippians 2 5. Quoting that may have been an ancient hymn or an affirmation of faith. Paul commences one of the most moving passages in his epistle, Philippians 2, 5 through 11, with a call to cultivate the mind of Christ within us. But what is the mind of Christ? Well, the mind of Christ recognizes the absolute sovereignty of the Lord God Almighty in all things. Let the mind of Christ be in us. The mind of Christ seeks God's will and God's way in all things and in all relationships. Let the mind of Christ be in us. The mind of Christ seeks forgiveness and reconciliation rather than revenge and getting even. Let that mind be in you. The mind of Christ seeks the least, the last, and the lost. The mind of Christ is concerned with those who are forgotten, neglected, abandoned, let the mind of Christ be in you. The mind of Christ is focused on peace, not just the, the, the absence of negativity, violence. Peace is the reign of God in all human endeavors. Peace is harmony among all. Peace is God's will and God's mind. Let that mind be in us. The mind of Christ is concerned with justice and rightness. Justice is the assurance that all have what each needs for life abundant and life everlasting. Righteousness is obedience to God's demand that we love God and our neighbors. Let that mind be in us. The mind of Christ seeks the, the best of each person we come in contact with, whether friend or stranger, whether near or far, whether ally or enemy. The mind of Christ is vitally concerned about the eternal soul of each individual. Let that mind be in you. The mind of Christ is filled with joy and thanksgiving to God for all of God's blessings. The mind of Christ knows that all that we have and all that we are granted, all blessings that sustain us, they are infinitely by God and of God because of God's love. 
The mind of Christ is a mind of gratitude. Let that mind be in us. The mind of Christ, let the same mind be in you that was in Christ Jesus. Philippians 2.5 Well, I look forward to sharing with you the next time on Fresh Manna Moments. I encourage you to stay in the Word because there is no other place to reside. Remember the blessings of Numbers 624 through 26. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace until we meet again. This is Reverend Dr. Alan G. Jenkins, Jr., Fresh Manor Ministries, Fresh Manor Moments. Shalom.